Yo, what's up, y'all, man? Welcome to um, Risky um, Behavior. Um, today, I stumbled across a video. This is a street pastor, um, and um, basically, he's down at the Pride Parade preaching, and um, you'll realize that they, they don't like it, nor do they appreciate it. You think that you're a woman? You're confused. This is this is confusion. You need to repent. Put on some pants. And go watch a football game or something. Grow your beard out and get back to being a man. Because when you stand before God, He's going to judge you as a man. He's not going to judge you as however you identify. He's going to judge. Hold on. Let me uh, rewind it to how that started. Because <laughs> the um, the trans person told him he, he was a clown and. Uh, it started a little argument between them. <laughs> Hold on. What is that? Yeah. Hold on, here you go. And that's why... You're a clown and everybody's laughing at you. Pardon me? You're a clown and everybody's laughing at you. You call me a clown, but you think you're a woman. You, but you think you're a woman, though. Like that—that's the pop, that's the pop calling the kettle black right there. Um, you you every day you wake up, you play you play dress up and masquerade. And I, I'm the clown. I'm I'm in touch with reality. You think that you're a woman? You are confused. This is this is confusion. You need to repent. Put on some pants. And go watch a football game or something. Grow your beard out and get back to being a man. Because when you stand before God, he's going to judge you as a man. He's not going to judge you as however you identify. He's going to judge you by how you were created. You, you need to read. We have no gender. We have no gender. You just said you're a woman. We have no gender in heaven. You can't say we yet. When you accept Christ, you can say we. We means everybody. You're not going to make it to heaven like this, though. You're not going to make it to heaven. No, transgenders. Wait, no, you're not. I'm in the land. There, there are no, there are no unrepented transgenders in the land's book of life. How would I know that? If I was a Christian, how would I know that? Because I mean, part, you probably read it. So did you read the part where it says repent? And a, a man should not wear, uh, a man should not wear, uh, a man should not wear clothes pertaining to a woman, and a woman should not wear clothes pertaining to a man. Um, what about when Jesus says male and female? He created them. Male and female. He created them. Look. <laughs> all right, all right. <laughs> oh man, it, it's sad, man. Because when you look at this person in their brain, they believe everything that they're saying. Like it's ridiculous. He looks in the mirror and he thinks he sees a woman. He looked like a dude. <laughs> he like a dude who drank a lot of beer and today. He just woke up and threw that crap on my life. He just looks silly, it, but he doesn't think he looks silly, man. It's that's why I always, when people talk about it being like a, um, like a mental disability or whatever, I, I, I'm inclined to believe them, man. Like, this is ridiculous. Anyway, man, y'all comment down below um, and tell me what y'all think about this video.